at the age of 61, I do everything I can to preserve my lower body power, not strength, power. Those are fast twitch fibers and fast motor units. Why do I do this? Because once you start losing these in your lower body parts, you are nearing medication status and a disease state. You will be on medication because it's all connected to the loss of muscle fibers and fast twitch motor units in your lower legs. So you must do everything you can to preserve these. I am going to show you in this video. Let's go. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the channel, June 24, 2025. Today, I want to speak to you about something very important concerning your lower body power called powerpenia, not dynapenia, which is loss of strength, and sarcopenia, which is loss of muscle mass. We are talking about powerpenia, which is the loss of power. Those are the type 2X that I always talk about, fast switch motor units and fast switch muscle fibers. Now, here's what I wanna ask you a serious question here. If you look at every single influencer on YouTube, what do you notice? I'm talking about Athlete X. This guy's, uh, I don't know if he's, he's not even 50 years old yet, and he openly admits that he can't do certain things with his legs. Uh, he can't jump, he can't do none of this. He admits this, he's one of them. But I'm speaking about every single influencer on YouTube from 40 years old on up. Not one of them, I mean, not one of them sprints, jumps, twists, you know, torque, agility. You don't see this. What do you see? Rope climbs, pull ups, muscle ups, push ups, uh, flexing. Oh, I'm ripped. I have a six pack. The sugar diet, this and this. you hear all this crazy stuff. They all look fantastic. Some of them are on steroids, some are non steroids, some of them are TRT. Anyway, it has no relevance. All they show you is the upper body. Yeah, you know, they, they show you their legs, they'll show you they're doing squats, strength, okay, strength, not power. Why? Because they lost power. This is why they don't show videos of them doing these power moves, talk movements, cutting, zigzagging like a youngster. They can do this. Some of them can do it. But you will definitely notice their age instantly because they lost that power. So now what is the problem with this? Studies show that lower body power is connected to multimorbidity. What does that mean? multimorbidity. It means it's connected to many diseases at once. In other words, you might get over, you might get away with this when you're in your late 30s, early 40s, maybe even up to 50 years old. But once you go above that, if you lost that, if you didn't train for it, you are nearing medications that you, you either are medication, taking medication for something to avoid disease, or you are nearing it. Because it's all connected to your leg, your leg power, your quads especially. Your quads is where you lose the power the most. Other studies show that people between 80 and 100, they lose a lot of power. Whatever they got remaining, they lose it on their, on their thighs, on their quadriceps. And they keep it on their wrists, the older people, because they use their hands. They, they can't use their legs. They don't use their legs. They sit. This is where the problem lies. This causes diseases. Your legs, circulation goes to your legs back up. Your fast twitch fibers, your fast motor units. I mentioned a million times. By the age of 75, you lost 50% approximately. Give or take a couple of numbers, a couple of digits. But you lost about half of your motor units. Everyone. Nobody's special. I don't care if you swim, if you do judo, kung fu, karate, pickleball. I don't care what you do, basketball. I don't care what you do. You could do whatever it is that you want to do. You're going to lose about half of your motor units by age 75. By age 90, you have maybe 10% left of your functional ability. That means the way you moved in your 20s at 90 years old, you're only 10% of that. Think about this. You are a walking stick, literally, frail. Why? Or it all goes down to the power, the muscle power in your legs. When you lose that power, the diseases are coming. 
ladies and gentlemen. You could be as powerful as you want. You could have all the strength. You could have all the variations. I see a lot of these guys. You could climb all the ropes you want. That's only upper body. Upper body is nothing. When it comes to longevity, it's not the upper body. It's the lower body that's in charge. The fast way, you need to train all your fast with motor units. I said this many times, but most people forget the lower part, which is the most important part. Why? Why? Because they either got hurt or they didn't know how to train or even the best sprinters in the world get slow. Why? Because they didn't continue. They didn't train right. Running a straight line will not do it. You need to do so many diverse movements, chaos training, baby, chaos, all kinds. You need to trick your mind. You need to trick your body. You, your body doesn't know what you're going to do. You just do it as you go along. That's what chaos training is. It's not pre-planned. Anyway, I just wanted to say this because there is absolute evidence that if you lose power in your legs, the more you lose, the closer you get to taking medications. And they say, oh, this, this is what they tell you. Oh, don't worry about it. You're healthy. You could have five diseases. You could take 10 medications. As long as you control your diseases, you have good health span. This is what Big Pharma tells you. And you eat that up. You say, oh, it doesn't matter if I got high blood pressure, high cholesterol, arthritis, prediabetes. My medication helps me. So that means I'm healthy. No, you're not. You're not healthy. Think about it. If you need something to keep you alive, how do you call yourself healthy? This is what Big Pharma wants you to believe. So you keep taking those pills. Me, as for myself, I will make Big Pharma go broke. If everybody did what I did, Big Pharma would go broke because everybody will retain their power. All of you on YouTube that are talking this smack about sugar and this and that, keep doing, keep going, keep going. When you get 65, 70 years old and you move like an old man and you're on meds, oh, you will be on meds, that's guaranteed. You go ahead and eat that sugar, fructose and all that nice stuff. Oh, I ride the bike 100 kilometers. My name is Dorian Rada. I am ripped. Jelly beans, sure you will. What are you, 46, 47? Talk to me when you're freaking 70, not just you. First of all, Dorian Ryder, he has no power. He has no power. He lost his power already. He's already set for the disease state. And medication's coming for you. Not only you, all of you. All of you that talk that nonsense on YouTube, <laughs> you don't show, you talk, blah, 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 blah. Show, show your youthful movement. If you can't show, you have the audacity to try to teach people how to stay young and youthful and healthy, and you don't show your own movements. Yeah, you talk a all talk a going. It sounds really, really, really impressive to talk it. Oh, that's what con artists do. That's what con artists do. At least Athlete X, he admits, he openly admits, he goes, I can't do this. My legs are messed up. He admits it. Some of them admit it. But you, show me how you move, and I will show you your real chronological age. You are all going to be on medication, and doesn't matter how ripped and oh my god and look 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 what it's doing to me i'm sh yeah okay okay all these guys doing these pull-ups oh you must go all the way up all the way down all the way up all the way up all the way down what does that mean what does that mean what about your lower legs what about your lower body how come you can't move you are already on medication most of you are already on medication you're just keeping it from the public 100%. Most of your medication and are hiding it. Anyway, I just wanted to share this with you. 
I'm not here to offend anybody. I'm telling you like it is. Like it is. You lost muscle power, you're in trouble. You must fight. For the people that are on my channel, my subscribers, you must fight at all costs to preserve the power you have left. Stop jogging. You can jog, but jogging doesn't help. Swimming doesn't help. Bike riding doesn't help. Or oh, walking 10,000 steps, that doesn't help. All that does is prolong your suffering on medication in your disease state. Look, you take it how you want to take it. I'm just giving you real facts here. Have a wonderful day, ladies and gentlemen. Stay healthy. I have many, many more explosive, and I mean explosive videos. Have a wonderful day. See you in my next video.